Hello and welcome to another uh, workshop vlog. This is going to be a really quick one tonight um, because it's been quite a long, long, long busy day of doing a lot of uh, prop making and stuff. So I thought I'd uh, very quickly share what a sort of kind of what an average day is in the workshop when I'm actually got some projects to do. So. Uh, <clears throat> Let's have a look, shall we? Okay, so before anything, again, apologies for the quality. Um, I am figuring out a way that I can rig my camera up in here, uh, all three of them, uh, to have some better footage and better quality, But because I'm essentially just setting up uh, properly. Well, it's going to be a while before that happens. So... Anyone who watches the blog, I apologise for crap quality audio and video. But anyway, um, so this is essentially what I've uh, been making today. Obviously this is a box and this is some compost. Uh, but as I showed in the previous blog with the avatars, the faces of winter uh, and autumn, we now have the face of spring. Which is very plain, deliberately, because um, I sort of wanted it to represent a bulb kind of thing. And bulbs are very, like, just ball, uh, bare. So this is actually quite a bulby head sort of thing. Uh, and then just to give it a bit of brightness, you know, to represent the daffodils and all the nice little flowers that come out in spring. It's a, uh, it's sort of like a hippified, tattooed style. Let's get it into the nice light, uh, on nicer light. Um, hippified, nice sort of uh, thing is on there. So yeah, so quite happy with that one. Um, so this is going to be set up. So not tonight because I'm knackered, but um, tomorrow night, hopefully, um, I'm going to do some filming, do some stop motion filming uh, of this. Now the idea will be that. Um, the mask um, sort of unburies in the film and it'll be stop motion so it'll look cool because uh, stop motion always looks cool and the way I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it in reverse so I will bury it and then when it's filmed it'll look like it's essentially sprouting sort of thing and it'll be framed, you can't really see it because of the dark sort of like that, so this will be dirt, all dirt here and then slowly we'll see more and more and more um so yeah so that's done here it's in here because originally i was going to do it outside and then um you know one of the main problems with stop motion is everything's noticeable when it comes to light so even though it was a lovely sunny day the problem is is the sun sort of starts here and then moves across to here as you're taking pictures because it takes quite a while to do stop motion, you, you sort of see that. Um, so it looks rubbish. So it's in here. So tomorrow night, this will all get blacked out. Um, the door will be closed and everything will be set up, ready for me to, to basically have a fully controlled light set up. Nothing's, nothing's changed in the workshop, apart from uh, Katie has now essentially finished her lovely lovely dressing table she's got some nice diamond style knob things on we're waiting for everything to dry and then hopefully tomorrow uh, it'll get out but yeah we've oiled everything sanded everything down and cleaned everything up and everything's been painted and there's some lovely hammerite on there to stop the old rust marks coming through so it all looks beautiful and then the other thing we've done today is this it's very simple. Another, it's another mask. Another avatar. Oh, look, the best him. Look, Bucky. We gave Bucky his bear back. And the problem with Bucky and his bear is Bucky likes to hump his bear quite a bit, which is a bit awkward. But it calms him down, obviously. Um, and he doesn't leave it alone. Earlier on, he was laid down next to it. He was proper spooning it. Bless him. Um, anyway, by the by. So yeah, so this mask is a very simple, sort of elegant design to represent summer. It's sort of like a 
Golden Geisha is what I'm calling it. Um, I'll just put that there. And that's some all set there. Those the springs going to go there. Uh, that's a better look at autumn. Um, when I first made that, those leaves were all like the really lovely autumnal colours. But obviously, because the real leaves, it dries out. But that's going to play perfectly into um, the film to show it's aged and it's a bit decrepit. That's in the script. So, yeah. So, that's today. Uh, today's work. Many hours put into that. Um, probably would have got done more done um, if I wasn't doing other things like setting up the sites and stuff like that. Um, but more on that later. So, thank you for watching and goodbye.